Everyone, welcome back to Condemned Crew. Ah, it's time for padding level 101. So why are you in on this? Because I'm I evil. A sense of responsibility. I needed to help. And I'm evil. Help. You mean with my investigation? Evil! Yes, among other things. <laughs> there was a time I thought I was the best investigator the Bureau ever had. Now it seems they were interested in me for other reasons. What do you mean? I saw my file. I'm the Dover I'm some sort of circus freak to them. I can foosh or adopt people's heads off. That may not be helpful. I wonder how much they know of what is happening. I would stay away from the Bureau as long as I could. It's not like I have much choice, since they still think I killed those two officers. Their deaths were unfortunate, but maybe it's best this way. Nah. Best? You seem to know a lot more about what's happening than you're letting on. This is Appleseed Orchard Estate. Stay on your toes. I'll drop you off at the house and head over to the barn. I'll meet up with you later. You know, we have to split up. It's standard horror procedure, you know. Oh boy. We're connected. Go ahead. Through the valley of the shadow of death. I will spare no evil. Strange. It looks important, though. Look around. There may be more to this riddle. Yes. It's called Pull This Out, The Dark Path to Righteousness. Oh, wait. And then you get to follow the four winding paths all over the fucking house. Um... And find four clues. Okay. First things first. <laughs> Let's get a fucking weapon. Okay, one of the clues is in here. A clue, perhaps. See if you can find more. Ooh! Tom. Uh, let's see. There's another one in the basement, which is infested by crack zombies. Crack zombies. <sighs> Too bad I can't meta game. Fuck this. Fuck off. Goddamn. Ooh. Large pipe. The crack zombies. Shell. Ah. Excuse you! No! Oh shit. No! 
That is a bad crack body party zombie thing. Oh shit. Okay. Of course, I took the fucking long way around. What the hell? Excuse you, sir, where are you? Fuck off. How rude. Oh, it's a flat door. I think there's a bathroom around here some where that didn't have anything in it. Okay, never mind. What? Oh. <laughs> well, fuck! I'll take a fireplace poker. Shit. If only I could find a crowbar to get into the... Actually comes out and loops back around. Okay, yeah, the other two are upstairs. Uh, first things can't get in there. from a Cthulhu's license plate. Fucking sledgehammer. Well, the other one's behind the sledgehammer door. The sledgehammer's here. Ah, yes, the last piece is in the attic. There's one on each floor. I want my fireplace poker back. I think there's crack zombies up in the attic. Oh, hello. Don't mind if I do. Uh, ooh, the block's better. Eh, I want to stab people with a. Yes, let's have our ch small child play with the dead birdie. Yeah, there's drugs up here, shit. Alright, it wants me to go that way. This means it may be prudent to go this way first. Smack a bitch with a piece of wood. Definitely some fucking... Oh shit! Hi, Cthulhu! Very well, not Cthulhu, but Cthulhu's ninja hitman. Fuck you! How did you block out of a... Mac, you stupid! Oh, I'll take one of your Ninja Cthulhu sticks.
Hmm, the dark path to righteousness is who are you metagame. Hmm. Couldn't be that, you know, giant mirror that I was smacking and kicking at earlier, could it? Metagame, metagame, metagame. Oh, crack zombie. Aw, oh, ain't that cute. He's still stuck in the support thing. You know, next time you're gonna get yourself stuck up there, swallow a couple bags of candy beforehand so we can use you for a fucking pinata. Horrible crack zombies. like it's about me. It is. Did a quick scan. There's a few newspaper stories about your investigations. It's even got internal bureau newsletter articles on your career progress, promotions, postings, things like that. The last few pages are newspaper clippings about serial killers not being found. Some of these are circled in red, with a big exclamation point beside them. Looks kind of like our serial killer X has been following your life and career pretty closely. Oh, great. Yeah, but why? I did find his masturbatorium. Maybe, maybe, but I don't know. Seems more to it than that. Uh oh. Evil bum monsters are invading upstairs. Better go take this crowbar and get into the gun cabinet. Uh, I thought there was a. Sniffy little crack zombie following me. Greetings! Oh, oh, convenient. I can't squeeze my fat ass through there. God, please. I can't take this anymore. My ears. My hands. There's a subby in there with a full clip as well. <sighs> God damn it. Engage padding. Now we're going to be invaded by homeless people and bums and addicts and hobos. And we have to wait until one of them is kind enough to give us a shotgun. Or not a shotgun, a uh... Wow, that one's kind of resilient. We gotta wait until one of them is kind enough to give us a fire axe. A fire axe to chop that. Who jumped out? Who came in? Hello? We're all. Excuse me, sir. Let me go get this submachine gun. You're a big one, too. making that noise again. That means incoming bum. Come on, guys. Stop padding. 
the clue thing is annoying enough. Running around the house. I mean, the clue thing. The clue thing's okay. Kinda. It's more just this. Sledgehammer. It's more just this fucking waiting bullshit for the right guy to come in with the right weapon. Although I'm pretty sure the whole thing is not so much waiting as it is scripted. Like Nazi zombies with hobos. Ah, excuse me, sir. Oh, that is a shovel. A shovel is not what I require. Although, you know, I think a crowbar could. I'm fairly certain a crowbar or something could do the job, but no, you have to have a fire axe. off. Ooh, cherry pie. Okay, I have six bullets left. Can the fire axe guy come leaping through a window without the greatest of ease? So I can just fucking drop the rest of the clip into him. Plot. No, no. Fire axe. Oh my! I had to do the fire axe thing! So I could slide the piano because I couldn't clamber over it because I'm too fat. Bag killed himself. Transfer when ready. Uh, no. I found the trace evidence. Oh, I wasn't standing in the right spot. Cross referencing print. A positive match. This guy's Carl Anderson, the one the press calls the torturer. Christ, it looks like serial killer X got to him, painted him up, tortured him, drove him to suicide, just like Anderson did to his victims. Our man must be near. Be careful. Your lab access is terminated as of now. Taxpayers wouldn't like you using resources when you're officially on suspension. Fair oh, I'm this actually doing my job. Talk to Rosa. We're this close to getting the guy. I don't Kinda. know what poor innocent schmuck you're chasing, but stop it now. Come Bad Ethan. Bad. Up up and we'll talk. There are things we need to discuss. I can't do it, Farrell. Then play it your way, but we'll find you. Count on it. Looks like you're on your own, Thomas. Carl. Carl. Quick. Come, Mr. Torturer. Steal his clothes. Don't you want to know what it feels like? We're not even half done. Carl. You know how this will end. I was put on this earth to bring you to justice. Your fate is in my hands. Yourself. Now I'll have to do the job and make it look right. 
So sad. Now, you shouldn't have come here. Oh, what are you? <laughs> yeah, fuck fighting him. <laughs> You're supposed to catch up with him and You're weak. and do battle. I just noticed that he actually had a shotgun this time. Cause he can be a fucking. There's a point. I did not. This is gonna be a lot easier. How did I know I have? <laughs> There's some reason I can't use my taser on him. And I got donked by a shovel. That's actually a lot easier. I'm glad I noticed that shotgun. Oh, and of course, Van Horn's an evil douchebag. Go figure. Leland, nephew, please listen to me. I am here to help. You are not yourself. You are not in your right mind. Let me help you. I know of what I speak. I... Ah, Leland Strangle! So... Alright, so when we come back, I'll see you for, I think it's the last chapter next. Might be. Or anyway, I'll see you next time. Later.